I'm going to talk about women versus men at pool, and in particular what we can learn from Fargo ratings. And I'll start with something on which we can all agree. Although there are about an equal number of men and women on the planet, there are far more high-level male pool players than there are high-level female pool players. Why is this? That's a subject for another day. What I'll talk about today is how the play of high-level females compares to male players. Here's an interesting chart that we'll come back to. On the right, you see seven of the top 20 female players in the world and their Fargo ratings. On the left are prominent male players who have ratings in the same range as those female players. Simon Chen is the highest rated female player in the world by Fargo ratings. She has a rating of 771. And as you can see, the, the four players, Alvin Ocean, Skylar Woodward, Corey Duell, and David Alcade, all have ratings within six or seven points of Simon Chen. All are Moscone Cup level players. Karen Kaur has a rating of 725. That would put her about the top 75 amongst all players in the United States. Some are surprised to see this correspondence, and others just flat out don't believe it. So that leads to what I'm really going to talk about today. Is a female 700 in Fargo ratings equal to a male 700 in Fargo ratings? In other words, is this an apples-to-apples -apples comparison? Why wouldn't it be? Other than violating somebody's smell test or preconceived ideas or interpretation of experience, why even have this conversation? Here's why. If we lived in a world where men only played men and women only played women, Fargo ratings would be unable to compare the play of men to the play of women. For Fargo ratings to work, we need connections between the two groups. We don't need direct connections between the top women players and the top men players, but we do need connections between the groups. So what we need is games played between men and women. In fact, we need minimum of, say, several hundred games to get the ratings of women and men to line up. What we actually have is tens of thousands of games of coupling between men and women. So a 700 woman and a 700 man play at the same speed. A 500 woman and a 500 man play at the same speed. In case you're not convinced of this, I'm going to show you a bulletproof test. Well, if Einstein was solving this problem, he would do what he called a Gedanken experiment. That's a thought experiment. You've seen these before, like twins where one stays on Earth, the other does space travel, and they compare their ages later. Or from others, a cat that's simultaneously dead and alive. So here's a Gedanken experiment with a twist. I want you to imagine with me that we had two players that play exactly the same. They have the same ball making ability. They choose the same patterns. They rack the same. They break the same. They are identical in every way. It's our thought experiment. We can do this. Bibi and Babu play exactly the same. We don't know what Fargo rating Babu and Bibi have, but remember, they play identically, so it must be the same. So here's what we're going to do. Babu is going to play 1,000-plus games in open events against men. U.S. Open Nine Ball, Turning Stone, Regional Tours, only against men, and Babu's going to get a Fargo rating. Bibi is going to play 1,000-plus games only against females in WPBA events, uh, regional tours, only playing against females, and B is going to get a Fargo rating. And remember, Babu and BB play identically. So if Babu plays only against men, BB plays only against women, and they end up with the same Fargo rating, all is good with the world. But if it's true that a woman 700 is a lower speed than a male 700, then there's a clear consequence here. BB is going to end up with a higher Fargo rating than Babu. If only this wasn't merely a thought experiment. If only we actually had Babu and Bibi. Well, we do, because Babu and Bibi are actually both Karen Core. Karen is a top-level female pool player who has made a career embracing competition wherever she can find it. She's played many, many thousands of games against both male players and against female players. Everybody knows Karen's played against all the top women, but which men has she played? Well, there's Shea Van Boning or Colo. Copigny, Mazan, Jason Shaw, Ralph Suquet, Warren Kiamko, Thurston Holman, Earl Strickland, Dennis Hatch, Jason Clapp, Daryl Peach, Stevie Moore, Brian Deska, Sean Wilkie, Ernesto Dominguez, Louis Ulrich, Mike Davis, Hunter Lombardo, Mika Eminen, Johnny Archer, John Mora, Danny Hewitt, and many more. So then we take all of the games Karen Court played against women and we sign them to BB, all the games Karen played against men, and we assign them to Babu, and we let Fargo rate do its thing. So here we go. Here's Karen, here's Bibi, and here's Babu, all within tenths of a point. 
So Simon Chen at the top really does play even with Albin, Skyler, Corey, and David. Those four are all world-class players who are a threat to go deep into any major international competition. So is Simon Chen. If you're wondering about the role of the break, remember that the break is baked into these numbers. So if, in fact, Simon Chen doesn't break as well as some of those players, she must be doing something else at a higher level to compensate. Can we do the same analysis for somebody other than Karen Core? Well, there aren't very many players that fit the bill of a lot of games against women and a lot of games against men, but Sarah Miller from Arizona is one. She has a rating of 543. She's played in many WPBA and other female-only events. She's also played a lot of matches against men, mostly amateur players in Arizona. So we've started this process over. We've assigned the games to Bibi and Babu, and we find that Sarah, Bibi, and Babu all have the same rating within one point. In conclusion, the Fargo ratings that you see for men and the Fargo ratings that you see for women mean exactly the same thing. And in fact, Fargo ratings allow us to rate every pool player in the world from beginner to top pro on the same scale.